Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. I'm Emily, the home bookkeeper, and I'm also the director of my business financial services and development firm, EDJ Consulting Group. On this channel, I help business owners and fellow freelance bookkeepers navigate the ever-changing QuickBooks Online. As always, this is a sample company provided by QuickBooks for educational purposes only. In today's video, we are going to go over some of the popular data report types of reports you can generate in QuickBooks Online. Head over to the handy dandy toolbar and click on the Reports tab. Once in the report screen, you will see the favorite most common reports listed first. As you scroll down, here are other reports broken down into report categories. You can click the star icon to edit your report favorites. QuickBooks makes it super easy for you to find the reports auditors may be requesting in the event of an audit. The most common report is a profit and loss report. I like to send this to my clients every month and do a one-on-one -on -one review of this report as often as they need. You can change the reporting period and even show a cash or accrual accounting method. Once you have the specifications edited to your liking, click the Run Report button. Here you can see the report generated all the income, liabilities, assets, and expense details. It's important to become proficient in reporting whether you are a business owner or a bookkeeper because it's crucial to know where your business stands financially. Reports are also frequently requested by banks if the business owner is looking for a business loan or maybe a line of credit, or if the business owner is even looking to make any personal financial moves. Thank you for tuning into this video make sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. Don't forget to turn on your bell notifications to be alerted when I post a new video. For a full list of my professional services, feel free to visit edjconsultinggroup.com.